Hey, hey, you know me, it's Ray from the world-famous comedy food truck. Glad you're here checking us out, Just Some 411. We are on YouTube. Make sure to subscribe, Apple Podcast, and Spotify. You can also stalk us on Facebook and Instagram at Comedy Food Truck. <laughs> <laughs> that was deep and thick. You're listening to the Comedy <laughs> Food Truck that was Podcast. That had we some, talk life, some food, relationships, and have fun with all of it. <laughs> that came from the back. Now here's your host, comedian John Hill. <laughs> that came from a roundabout. <laughs> yes, yes. Yes, yes. Nothing but shenanigans, even more before we turn on the cameras. <laughs> Shenandoahigans. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Oh, Everyone's boy. falling out. He's <laughs> choking. Kick pop. Man. Oh, man. All right. Listen, welcome to October, mm. where it's still 105 degrees in the Inland Empire. <laughs> it's never going away. The heat is never mm. going away. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I hate you, Gloria Stefan. The heat is on. Oh, that's, she that's, didn't sing that's that. That's Glenn Fry. That's Glenn Fry. Yeah. You're right. I don't know. What is, what's the one she sings about uh, heat? Oh, there's something. something about Miami. I don't know. Dun, 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 dun. Anyway, I think the heat's in there, too. I don't like Glenn Fry either. Glenn Fry. What singing about like heat. Fry. French Fry? French Fry. French fry. The Hot oil? He wasn't original. He was the Eagles. He's not original. He's, oh. He replaced somebody. We're about to fight. He replaced somebody. In the Eagles? Yes. No, he did not. Yeah, Fry. Yeah, Phil not. Collins. Remember Phil Collins? He was a <laughs> Jimmy Page. He replaced Jimmy Page. <laughs> Jimmy Page when he was in the Eagles got replaced by That's right. Glenn Fry. <laughs> right. Oh, Learn boy. your VH1 behind the story. <laughs> behind the story. Behind behind the music. Story. <laughs> Whatever it's called. Behind my behind. Behind. <laughs> no, trouble. Glenn Fry's cool, but he should have stopped trying to act. Remember we tried to be in Miami Vice oh, or something? Yeah. Was he in Riptide or something like that? He was, was in Riptide? something. What's happening? I don't think so. I don't know. I can't remember. He sang The Heat Is On? Yeah. But it wasn't an Eagle song. No, it was solo. I just remember from Beverly Hills Cop. Mm-hmm. Solo? Two. Mm-hmm. He is. All right. Um, <laughs> ha! Okay. Welcome to the show, folks. We're really rolling now. After really? last week's episode, we just thought we'd come back and really kill it. Right. Mm-hmm. Coming on strong. But no, but listen, let me introduce the crew. Jared to my left. Hello. Say hello to the peeps. Hello, peeps. And then uh, Scotte. Yo, what's up? Scotte the Bate. Peeps. Yes, saying hello. What's up? What's up? How are you, sir? I'm good. I'm good. I, I, I like to see. I just let him go. Yep. If I stay quiet long enough, <laughs> Scott will say the same thing 14 times. <laughs> Feels the silence. Indifferent. Good. Pretty good. Yeah. Great. That's Dark. great. That's great. <laughs> And then it's like you're going through the drawers in like a kitchen and you're finding this stuff. <laughs> that's that's it. Oh, there's that. There you go. Oh, yeah. that. <laughs> just opening, opening cabinets yeah. and looking around, just kind of rummaging around looking for stuff. He's like Kramer from Seinfeld. He's just <laughs> <laughs> <"Giddy up." laughs> and then, oh man! And then the host for our show mm. today, wow. the leader of our topic. The man, my guy, that guy, that guy, Ray, the host with the ghost, that guy, Ray, Stories. the hostess that's it, with the mostest. Yeah, with being that's October right. and all, scary. Well, that's the point I was going to get to. Is that it is the beginning of October, which for some people builds up toward the end of October, which is Halloween, which is really the next night after what is it? All Saints, All Soul, what is it? All oh, Hallow's Eve. Yeah, no, Hallow's no, Eve, oh, but then, uh, no, it's, or yeah. it's the pre to the Dead Day. All Souls Day? Deo, yeah, Deo, All Souls Deo, or Leo, Deo, 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 some Catholic thing. Dio de los Muertos. 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 Dio de los Muertos. I don't know if it's that, but it may be. But I know there's, now we have Catholic friends listening to the show. I'm like, well, you're going to bang on us. Well, you know. <laughs> Why are you going to bang on us? <laughs> like, I'm still, I'm still doing that Latin American music. Bang, bang, bang. <laughs> Why are you bang, bang. Bang? Why are you gonna bang on us? That's John Witherspoon right there. Bang bang. There you go. <laughs> got the coordinate. Uh, it's you a got the coordinate. It's a K-pop song. Bang 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 bang. Bang 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 bang. Cake pops. Right. Cake, cake pops. I know we should get a shot of the cake pops, but I don't want anybody to mess with them. Yeah. Yeah. Put it, it in front of the camera. Yeah. We have a few. Well, thank of these. you to our sponsors, books, uh, who gave us. How many Actually, Scott? No, it's not true. But we, we, <laughs> Roughly fifteen thousand. We were able to obtain <laughs> cake pops. So, well, but I'll be real. We in our church we have a food uh, ministry that feeds folks who are hungry, and 
they get lots of donations and and they got a donation of way more cake pops than can possibly be eaten before they mm-hmm. expire. But says, we thank you. It says for birthday that. cake pop. Yeah. Clean, not labeled. Right. That's what it, it says. It just means it's not ready for resale. Yeah. They're clean. Yeah. So clean and not labeled. They haven't set up for resale, but created on August fourth. But really cool that uh, they were donated. So we actually uh, that doesn't matter. That's like describes our show. Yeah. Clean, yeah. clean, and not labeled. <laughs> <laughs> not ready for resale. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but anyhow, uh, in honor of building up toward the big day at the end of the month that people like to, for some reason, on purpose, scur themselves, uh, I'm going to turn it over to Ray. Mm. Ray, what what you got for us today? Hey, guys, we are revisiting our urban legends. Bomp, bomp, bomp. By state. Oh, we did this. We wow. did this before. So it's explain just, how this works again. It's yeah. this big list, and it's all fifty states, and it's like it's like their number one urban legend. And ah. what, I'll, what I'll do is I will tell you the legend, and we have to guess the state, and you can try and guess the state. Okay. It oh. actually gives it actually gives you a, a city and state, but I'll just take. Feel feel free to play yeah. along in the audience and mm-hmm. the crowd. What do you say, Phil? Phil. 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 Well, feel. Could, I, it would kind of be yeah. A few feel. episodes ago, feel. you could say Wendy when Wendy. you're talking about Wendy. I can say Phil. Can, did you? Did you? <laughs> when I'm trying to say feel. <laughs> <I'm> just, <laughs> did you feel? Did you feel the? Did you feel how Wendy it was yesterday? <laughs> right. <laughs> right. Nice. I was feeling it. I was feeling the wind. I'm not feeling you. <laughs> I'm not feeling the wind. Wind. Yeah. The wind. Scott Bonix. The wind. Scott, Scott Bonix. <laughs> Scott Bonix. <laughs> <laughs> wow Scottophonics The mm. whole Urban Dictionary f- The whole facility Just rolled over In it's grave They're like No we're not putting <laughs> in We're not putting in Scott topic definition it's because Scottophonics it's, it's because it's The OC translation It is It's Orange the Orange County yes, translation Which yeah. isn't really Our Orange County For Scott The OC is more Just out of control Or <laughs> yeah. Right Off color Open casket <laughs> Open casket <laughs> 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 That's <crazy>. awful cold. <laughs> awful because he spells it. But he says it awful. 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 Awful cold. That's awful. That's awful because that's how you spell awful. Awful. O F F L E. It's awful. Yeah. It's awfully cold. That's it. It's awfully. Awfully. Oof. Oof. Turn it Man. off. Let go of my egos. My Good waffles. Grief. Turn it off. My off. Where's your off button? Where's your off button? <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna call somebody and pay him to off you. <laughs> Outbreaks of tuberculosis. <laughs> is this our first one? Mm. Are you guys ready? You got any scary music, or is your music machine not working it's, again? Oh, we could try it. We'll see if see it works. Poops out. One second. This I don't have anything scary. <laughs> no. There it went. No, because I never. I haven't mixed. We didn't yeah, have if you turn stuff. on Monster Mash, I'm gonna come over to the other side of the table and smack you. <laughs> That'd be a good one. Huh? The put Monster it in and post Mash. again. Yeah, we'll just do it. Not find some scary. Right. Post edit. How about some uh, the Charlie Brown Halloween song? Mm. You know that it's the piano. Red Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. Isn't it the same oh, music as they always have? Yeah, the well, piano it's, music. Well, it's not copyrighted. It's not really Linus and Lucy Halloween music. It's Charlie Brown music. Yeah, you know when they're tooling through the yeah pumpkin patch. But that's not a specifically Halloween song. No. Outbreaks of Bert. Somebody just hum scary music. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm just challenging the assertion that the Peanuts tune is scary. Do you do you remember? Remember they had that. It was an LP. They had, you could buy that record, and it was oh, the, yeah. it was the Halloween sounds, scary sound. Yeah. You just put it on. It was just you like just ambient. put it on repeat when you're running like one of your fake haunted houses at your yeah. house. Yeah. And the needle would pick up. Right. <laughs> or your middle aged dad. Hear it, you'd hear it like. <laughs> your middle aged dad wants to stand still on the porch while somebody comes up so he can move and scare him. Right. <laughs> scare six year olds. <laughs> Take their candy. Boo. Right. <laughs> Boo! Boo, I say. Boo, I say. Because he knows the rest of the year he can't approach kids with candy and get away with it. Right. One time a year I get away with it. Goes out in dolphin shorts and some I tube like, socks. <laughs> and flip flops. I like to use candy to scare kids, but I usually can't get away with it. You know how I went and done that? <laughs> dolphin shorts. My socks go all the way up to my knees. What are you supposed to be, the milkman? This isn't a costume. <laughs> okay. I go down to my van by the river. It's got puppies and candy in it. Puppies and candy. <laughs> mm. Outbreaks of tuberculosis. I think that was a song by uh, <laughs> Cat Stevens. 
Who's the dude that did? Uh, I thought it was Glenn Frey. No, no, the Cradle. Uh, oh, it was uh, Harry Chapin. No, Cats in the Cradle. Cats in the Cradle. Yeah, it's Harry, Harry Chapin. 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 Is he the one that did Puppies and Candy? I don't know. <laughs> puppies and Candy in the Van. I think so. that was Barbara Streisand. Clone, I think it was Cher. Clone, clone I thought puppies. It, I thought it was Phil Collins. It was Engelbert Humperdinck. It was Cher. Humperdinck. Humperdinck. <laughs> flame of flame, baby. Man, we are losing. Our, our, our audience is like, you guys used to be funny. This is good, dumb. Oh, my God. <laughs> you have nothing, do you? You have no show whatsoever. <clears throat> Race tried to start it about eight times. I now. know. Outbreaks of tuberculosis <laughs> caused a vampire scare in 1892 when a full family contracted the disease while most of her family's bodies decomposed. Mercy's body seemed to be frozen in time, making people suspect her to be a vampire. While it was obviously superstition, the legend persisted. And she is Mercy Brown, the vampire. Murphy Brown? Oh, this is the Mercy. urban legend. Mercy Brown. Candace Bergen? Where Mercy is she from? Brown. Is this a... Um, are these... Are, yeah, right. Are all these answers <laughs> in America, or are they these all, are all the world? These are all states. These are states. States United, in America. The, the 50... Uh, one of the 50 states. Mercy Brown. Yep, this is number 39. Mercy Brown, the vampire. So is there one for each state? Like, once yep. we pick a state, there's not another one. Got yeah. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So her Vampires. whole family contracted. They all died, but for some reason, she didn't decompose. Wow. Maybe she had a lot of preservatives. So she was dead, but she just didn't rot? Yeah, the other oh. ones rotted faster than she rotted. Mm. She was a slow rotter. So they were like, mm. wow. So silver bullets and tuberculosis get vampires. Yep. Okay, <laughs> got it. <clears throat> That's got to be, uh, wow. And it's tuberculosis, so an outbreak. That mm -hmm. had to be back in like 1800s or something. What year Outbreaks of tuberculosis caused a vampire scare in 1892. Got when it. a full family contracted the disease. While most of their family's bodies decomposed, Mercy's body seemed to be frozen. I'm going to say... OC, open casket. Colorado. Mmm. No. I don't even think they were that This is a west. weird one. You're not going to get this. We're going to get the state? Yeah. I just realized it's a weird one. What? what we have weird states? Mm-hmm. <laughs> There's only 50 of them. Yeah. I, know. I don't remember what we guessed last time, but so we may have already guessed this, but... I'm going to go with West Virginia. Mount Mama. Right. No. What I'm about going to say South Virginia, <laughs> South Dakota. No, I feel like it's northeast. Is it in the northeast? It is northeast, and it's a small state. Rhode Island. There you go. Buck, Bucksport, Bucksport or Bucksport, yeah. Bucksport, Rhode Island. Okay. I don't know about Buck, but I'm not interested in sport. <laughs> Bucksport, <laughs> Rhode Island. Bucksport, Bucksnort. Uh, did we do this? One? Bucksnort. Bucksport. I don't did have any one. illegal narcotics. I will snort a buck. <laughs> I'll just snort the money. The buck. That we <laughs> don't <really> do like. <laughs> it. Don't snort the money. Stop That's already. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. I'm going to randomly pick another one. Here it comes. Okay. Here it comes. <clears throat> Moving through. The Casadoa Spiritualist Camp is full of odd ghosts but one chair supposedly is a favorite for the big cheese himself. According to local lore, if you sit in it, he'll whisper horrible things in your ear, forever changing you, and if you leave a beer on his chair overnight, he'll drink it, sometimes even if the can is still sealed. And it's called the devil's chair. Mm. Wisconsin. <laughs> Worried about beer, I know. Not Wisconsin. Actually, my first. It is Wisconsin. Not Wisconsin. Oh, my first instinct was Oklahoma. That's what I was no, gonna I was say. Thinking more like Arkansas. Close. <laughs> yeah. All I whisper back to the devil when he whispers my ears. At least I didn't lose my golden fiddle to some guy in Georgia. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Uh, is there a region you can help us with? Maybe we get a better guess. Southeast. It, well, we were in the right region. Okay. Mm -hmm. I said Arkansas, but I guess mm -hmm. not. How about we had Louisiana last time? Go ahead. Alabama. Negative. Wow. And just the beer wow. thing. I was gonna say Texas even, but it's so Mississippi. Big. Nope. Mister like, Sippy. I feel like Texas would have a more Sister respectable S urban legend. Sister Sippy. Sister Sippy. Mississippi. Mister Sippy. Um, I don't even know. It is the, the the most southeast you can go in Florida. the United States. Florida. Yeah. Jeez, I would have expected more wow. out of Florida. That's their best urban legend. Casadaga. Or Casadega, Casadega, Florida. 
They got a stupid legend. That is that's Tyler David. <laughs> <laughs> Florida's legend's lame. Yeah, stupid that's state just hanging out there all by itself. Stupid. stupid. Is Casa Dagan next to Talladega? I figured they were a legend of all banjos. <laughs> this is one about me. <laughs> this is one about you. A saving, a uh, saving, saving foot. <laughs> what? <laughs> a seven foot tall specter whose job it is to collect the souls of suicide victims stalks lonely, depressed adolescents. Perhaps he's an explanation for the alarming high <laughs> suicide rates in the area of the few recent attempts at mass suicide. Mm. His name is. Walking Sam. Walking Sam. Sam. Alaska? You better watch out. Walking Sam will get you. (laughs) Walking Sam or Joaquin Sam? Walking, like a guy walking around. I wonder how long it took him to come up with that one. Yeah. Walking Sam. Rash of mass Just refer to me as Walking Sam. I'd be more Uh, scared of running Sam. Yep. Sam, I am. Is it it Alaska? It's actually on an Indian reservation. Ooh. And it's not Alaska? Not Alaska, a seven-foot-tall specter whose job it is to collect the souls of suicide victims stalks lonely, depressed adolescents. Perhaps he's an explanation for the alarming high suicide rates in the area of few recent attempts at mass suicide. Scary. I don't know. How about Montana? No. Big Sky? No. Uh, <laughs> Isn't I, Big Sky in Montana? Mm-hmm. Yeah. He wasn't thinking Big Sky yeah. was a country. No. Uh, Not for a state. Uh, Pine Ridge Indian Reservation. Pine Ridge. Is it next to Rock Ridge? <laughs> That's where the railroad's going through. Hmm. I, 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 there's so many states. I don't even. I mean, it's so Tennessee. Hard. Black Hills Gold. Oh, uh, South, South Dakota. Dakota. South Dakota. Wow. See, I was early on this. Yeah. South Dakota. I was trying you to give North a good. Dakota. Trying to give a good hint. He said South earlier. No, you didn't. You said South. I'll run it back. You said South. <laughs> Anyone let's, who takes let's go to the tape. Petrified. <laughs> Hang on, we're gonna go upstairs said, and review this. I don't know why you're fighting this. You totally Hang said south. On. Hang on, let's review. Yeah, I did say south. <laughs> That's no. what he said. In post, no. can you roll it back? And no, then what you <laughs> said. <laughs> what you said <laughs> was South Dakota. Right. No, he, South Dakota. <laughs> That's not what you said. South. 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 Cody. <laughs> Anyone who takes petrified wood from the state park befalls bad oh, luck. Job loss, sickness, park. and accidents. Park managers claim they get dozens petrified of packages forest. every petrified year forest. sending back chunks of wood from regretful thieves. It's like cursed wood. Wait, there it's, is, like, it's like the there's it's a petrified, like the petrified forest. wood of Cortez. There's a petrified forest. What state is that in? I remember that. It's in... Arizona. Escalante. It the is? The curse on Escalante Petrified Forest. If you know where that is. Mm. I have no idea. Seems like it'd be southwest by the name, but is... Mm. So it's not Arizona. Mm. Is it Arizona? Close. How New about Mexico. San Diego? Close, sir. Texas? <laughs> up, up. Uh, Oklahoma. Hold on a second. Back west. How is San Diego closer than Arizona? <laughs> I just want, I just said <laughs> that so I can see a look on your face. And then uh, you said closer. Yeah. He was uh, talking to me, I think. Ontario. Canada. <laughs> Rialto. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying I'm playing Utah. Yeah. Utah. Yeah. Escalante. Escalante Petrified Forest. Do not take the wood, it is cursed. We're not doing any more trivia games. It is, it is bad. The food is bad. An ugly, stumpy critter with a spiky <laughs> tail. Jeez. Wow. It's Mickey Rooney? Yeah. <laughs> Paul Bunyan stories. It's Matt Damon. <laughs> Paul reportedly, Bunyan hurts. reportedly likes to eat bulldogs. Was it really a he Paul is, Bunyan story? He is story? called the Rhinelander Hodag. Is it really a Paul Bunyan did, story? Did you say Hobag? Hodag <laughs> with a D. Did you really say <laughs> Paul Bunyan in there? Paul Bunyan. He's a short, stumpy hobag. He's in, My name yeah. is Bunyan Holander. <laughs> the hobag features in Paul Bunyan stories <laughs> and reportedly, reportedly likes to eat bulldogs. Minnesota. Woo. No. Uh, Bunyan said Paul Holder. Bunyan. Isn't that a Minnesota thing? No. It's in Rhinelander. The Rhinelander hodag. Or hodag. There's a lot of Germans in Minnesota. It's number 49. 
Rhinelander. I'm going with the Paul Bunyan thing, though, is throwing me off because I thought he was up in the Great Lakes area. That's where that Northwest? legend came from. I don't know my geography well enough to know where this is. <laughs> I'm bring up a map. Well, the Northwest would be places like Washington, Oregon. And all uh, that. Probably, no, Midwest probably, probably more would Midwest. Be Detroit probably, or Michigan, Minnesota. Probably more, so more. Ohio, some of that stuff. More middle, yeah. Middle America? Yeah, That's but northern. The Midwest. America. Northern. Still northern. the Midwest. Nebraska? Yeah, but northern. Mm -hmm. there, is, there is no northern Midwest. It's just okay. Midwest. Okay, Midwest. It goes from basically Canada down to where you start the southeast. Okay. And then it goes from like the 13 colonies to the Colorado. Rockies. Hodag. Hodag. Where are all the Paul, Paul Bunyan Hodags at? <laughs> right. <laughs> the Hodag. Right. Or Hodag. <laughs> might be saying it wrong. I don't know. There's no pronunciation. I'm trying to think of where there's a jerk. Michigan. Uh, no. I'm trying to think of where there's. Oh, you said it was down lower. Well, I don't know. Wisconsin? Maybe yes, Wisconsin. Okay. Oh, Rhinelander, nice. Wisconsin. Well, wow. again, that's right next door to Minnesota, which is, I believe, where the whole one. Paul Bunyan thing. Because, again, isn't one. he somehow connected to the Great Lakes or something, Paul Bunyan? I just like I the know. name. I like they the were name of this Some one. story about him and his blue creating the, yeah, creating the Great Lakes. Huh. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I thought it was Minnesotian. Minnesotian. But I was close. Wow. Yeah. What's Uno, that? Uno Mas? Uh, let me find a Yeah, camera. Uno Mas. Bruno Mars. One with a good long description. Bruno Mas. A good description? Uh, Whoever gets this wins a cake pop. Cake Yay. pop? Oh, geez, I'm out. <laughs> I'll do it in ASMR. Too poop to pop. <laughs> Stories about strange deaths along the road as far back as Native American times and drownings in the nearby river made it a fun haunted spot for teenagers for decades, but many of them have perished in strange accidents. Huh. Today, dark shadows follow you, seen only out of the corner of your eye. The Zombie Road. That's what it's called? The Zombie Road. The Zombie Road. Mm -hmm. Mm. It's in Wildwood, New Mexico. <laughs> nope. Wild Mississippi. Nope. No, oh, but it sounds like Kansas. Hmm. Missouri. Misery. Wow. Wow. Wildwood misery. Watch out for that zombie road. Zombies in Missouri. Yep. That, wow. is, that is the zombie capital of the United States. <laughs> There's a lot of meth in Missouri. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Meth Missouri. Right. Meth Missouri. Meth Missouri. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh, ghost elephants. Night marchers. Water babies. Of night marchers. Night, water babies of massacre rocks. Jeez. Annabelle the demon doll. We know that one. Corpse light. Hmm. Wow. You crazy water baby. There, yeah. <laughs> the dark watchers. The whole bag. Dog whole bag. <laughs> dog boy. Not whole a werewolf. Bag. Not a werewolf. It's dog boy. Hog bag water baby. <laughs> That's what's in her bag. Uh, <laughs> water, baby. There you go. That's awesome. Okay. Such well, a great, scary I can, game. I just know that the whole audience is really super frightened right now. I see the scary pictures. Ooh. Ooh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. You Bring broke it. That's a, that's a to-do list. What are you showing this to? Us? My camera. Oh. All the urban legends. Those are all the ones on oh. your phone. Yeah, just pictures the, in the, the description. Pictures, yeah. Got it. Mm. Okay. Well, that's the water babies. So. Oh. It's like, a, <laughs> oh, it's like a giant ant from here. Right. In a balloon. There you go. Hmm. Well, that was fun. But on When are we going to start a cooking show? Yeah. Ah, oh, we should start. We again. should do that. Yeah. For your YouTube channel. Content. Cook something. What should we Contents. cook? Anybody got some ideas? Meth. Meth. <laughs> Jeez. We're well, not doing that again. We'll start with water babies. <laughs> <laughs> On a very special episode of the Comedy Food Trip. Wow, yeah, we have to get some cooking going. We should do some pizzas. Some pizzas. Yeah. We could do get John doing some barbecue. No, I don't. You guys are the chefs. Y'all cook. Yeah. You just come on and eat. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're cooking. You ain't said what you're cooking yet. Do some. What you, you guys? You what guys you are, want? You guys are that guy. We yeah, are that guy. You guys are that yeah. guy. What did you do cooking that one time? It was a uh, fettuccine chicken alfredo did, that I yeah, saw you do on chicken them? alfredo, and then we did um, steak and risotto. I think. Uh -huh. Yeah. Were those my, two characters on Laverne and Shirley? Steak and risotto. Yeah. 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 I hung out with Lenny and Squiggy. Yeah. yeah. 
right. stick and risotto. <laughs> <laughs> There's the dancer guy, yeah. risotto. Yeah, is it Carmine risotto? <laughs> oh, okay. Carmine. Carmine risotto. Carmine. Forgot about that guy. That's a name. The dude with the hair. Yeah, Carmine. man. It's like a helmet. Right. He was on Teen Beat every week. Right yeah. Then. Him wow. or Scott Bale. That's yeah, crazy. Scott Bale. He had a normal right. first name. Nobody likes Scott Bale now. Nope. I don't even know if that dude's alive. He still is. Is he? Yeah. Hangs out with Danny like Bonaducci, doesn't he? I think so. Danny Bonaducci. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. We'll start with pizza. What, yeah. what pizza? What's your favorite one to make? Mm. How about if the some. audience tells you what to make? All okay. right. What kind of pizza should we, we make? Some. Yeah. We can do some pizza. You, you guys go. put in your suggestions of what they what you want them to cook as a pizza, but also anything else you want them to cook. Yep. Right. And they'll start doing YouTube channels with, uh, you know, cooking with love. I don't know. What we do you call make, it? We should make Jello. Cooking with Jello. <laughs> Just call it cooking. Cooking <laughs> show. <laughs> <laughs> cooking time. <laughs> <laughs> time to cook. <laughs> <laughs> John's <Yeah>. broken. <laughs> yeah. Jeez. We do an we do an event in February at our uh, church. It's called Night to Shine. Uh. <laughs> we'll have you guys be a part of that. <laughs> you guys in there, right? Um, just yelling out random words. Yeah, cooking with Scott and Jared <laughs> and Ray and maybe John. No. Hodag. Nope. <laughs> Scott's Hodag cooking. Went bang. Water baby. <laughs> Scott's pizza. We could have water baby casserole. Oh, gross. Wow. Water baby loaf. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Just need to wrap this show up. <laughs> you better hurry. Scott, <laughs> Scott's special. <laughs> mm. All right, guys. Well, listen, seriously, they, they we are serious about them starting on their YouTube, doing some cooking. Yep. So if you'd like to have something made or learn how to make it or you want to see somebody make it throw a suggestion in the feed and uh definitely they'll start with pizza so whatever kinds of pizza you want to see that'd be great yep right let us know the rack backs the rack backs there you go on a windy day <laughs> <laughs> you've never said it the same way twice that's what's funny to me like a different voice Different accent, can different you, word. Can you can you feel it? Never. Can you can you feel it? Yes, I can. Can you feel the wind? I'm filled up to here. I'd like to do it on a windy day. See, just all over the offending every part of the world. <laughs> <laughs> offending everyone. <laughs> your only saving grace is you are you are not a respecter of offenses. You just. <laughs> I got here, buddy. Oh, I got you too. Wait, what everybody. about us? Oh, I get you too. I got everybody. No one. One, one second. What's everybody. offensive? Tell me. Tell me what it is. Yeah, I'll, work it. I'll work it in. Oh, you haven't made fun of any <laughs> Saskatchewans. I got you. Why don't you? Why don't, why don't the listeners? Why don't we just do this? Why don't the listeners just put what's offensive to them in the comments, <laughs> and we'll have Scott just talk do about it. it. Yeah. yeah. Whatever you do, Scott, don't do this, yeah. and then Scott will do it. We'll call it, we'll call it the comedy food truck trigger. The trigger right, show. The trigger show. Yeah, yeah. we'll just trick Josh is right. gonna, Scott's gonna trigger everybody. What's y'all. up, trigger? <laughs> <laughs> Man. Yep. All right. Goodbye. This is probably our last episode. <laughs> just we'll see if we're back next week. Put stuff in the feed. Let us know. <laughs> everybody say bye. Big bye. gulps, huh? See, see you later. Ya.